President Trump made remarks this afternoon about yesterday's shooting at the Capitol Gazette newspaper in Maryland. A man with a longtime grudge against that paper shot his way into the office, murdering five people. KCAU 9's Washington correspondent Morgan Wright reports on reaction from the Capitol. President Trump addressing the shooting at the Capitol Gazette newspaper in Annapolis, Maryland, calling it a horrific and horrible attack. This attack shocked the conscience of our nation and filled our hearts with grief. But Thursday, reporters shouted questions to him on the South Lawn, and he ignored them. Journalists, like all Americans, should be free from the fear of being violently attacked while doing their job. Five people lost their lives in the shooting tragedy on Thursday. Anne Arundel County police say this was a targeted attack by a man who had a long-standing grudge against the paper. He was upset over an article about a harassment claim against him. My government will not rest until we have done everything in our power to reduce violent crime. After the attack, Dan Shelley, the executive director of the Radio, Television, and Digital News Association, urged all newsrooms to enhance their physical security. Journalists are no more special than churchgoers or concert goers or students or nightclub patrons, uh, but this one hits close to home. I urge all journalists to watch their backs, but don't back down. And despite tragedy within their newsroom, the Capital Gazette still published a paper as scheduled Friday morning. Shows an amazing amount of bravery and courage and determination, and that's what we as journalists do. In Washington, Morgan Wright.